this video, I'll be sharing with you a grocery list that has a long shelf life. Today I went shopping and taste what I bought today. Brussels sprouts and long beans. Or it says on the back French beans, but long beans. <laughs> and I bought them because they can be stored in a refrigerator for weeks. I know that from my experience because a few times I forgot about them. And when I did remember, they were they looked fresh and good and still you can eat it, chop it, and make whatever you want with that. Whoa! Carrots. I had an idea to make uh, soup with um, split, uh, split green peas and carrots and potatoes. I made it uh, a little bit different the first time and my boys loved it. So I thought I'll create it again, I'll make it again and I'll make it in a two full, in a, to a full recipes. Oops into a full recipe because uh, people have been asking me what are the ingredients I used and because it came out so delicious I'll be creating it and sharing as a full video recipe. I bought the carrots because I know also they have a very long shelf life if it's in a cold room, if it's in the refrigerator or even if it's on the shelf in the kitchen they can be up to for a few days in the refrigerator for a few weeks for sure. So you can juice it, you can have soup with it, you can have uh, raw salad with it. I love my favorite raw salad, it's carrot garlic salad, but you can, can make anything you want with carrot. Yeah, so when they are in season, we, we buy in a big quantity and we grate them and we, uh, we pack and freeze it in the refrigerator. And when, I make, and when I'm just lazy to cook, from scratch or lazy to stand in the kitchen, I'll just grab the bag, I'll put it in a soup. So sometimes I'll make a soup with that. So, okay, let me take you on a tour to my cold room. I'll show you a few things and it's a little bit colder. So let me grab my jacket. So here I have potatoes, sweet potatoes, uh, garlic and onions and these ones are has a long uh, shelf life, especially if it's still stay in the cold room. But sometimes I'll keep it. Usually I keep it in my kitchen, and they're good for weeks. And here I have um, tomato sauce. When it's on sale, we should usually buy a whole bunch of uh, tomato sauce, and there's two kinds. This is my favorite one. And what about what's all this? And how much oil? Oh, and here we have oil, bunch of oil. Also, when it's on sale, Richard buy, buys a bunch of it. <laughs> because, okay, what the reason for why we have so much right now, or we always have, it's because um, my three boys are on school. They're home all the time, three boys. And my uh, husband is working from home. So it's non-stop of eating and cooking. There's always action in the kitchen all the time, all the time. So let's go. Okay, so I, I don't come here. I don't organize here because it's too cold. I'm doing only in the summer. So usually Richard cleans and organize here everything. So, um, our apple cider vinegar, it's apple cider vinegar. It's another thing that will, of course, will uh, ha has a long shelf life. Um, some of uh, flowers and I have a bunch upstairs. And as I said before, um, Brussels sprouts, uh, green peas, and here uh, beets and apples. Also, they have a long shelf life and they're very good in a cold room to keep them in a cold room some fruits and vegetables. Oranges are very, very good. So if you are on lock, lockdown and the oranges are very uh, kept well, potatoes, carrots. Onions, sweet potatoes. Sweet potato, sweet potato. lots of sweet potatoes. Look at the peanut butter. 
This one is uh, gluten-free wraps. Tofu that can be kept a long time in a refrigerator. So, then, uh, what else? Uh, pasta we have, some crackers that are gluten-free. And here we have some dry fruits and uh, seeds. And I'm freezing. I would like to go out from here. And if you have some questions, and here we have, and here we have some uh, hummus, hummus, <laughs> hummus, hummus uh, that my boys love and eat it almost every single day. Oatmeal that they love to eat in the morning with um, frozen blueberries. And um, that's, it. that's it for now. I'm freezing. I'm gonna go upstairs. If you have some questions, uh, let me know. But in the link below, you'll see. Um, you'll have the link for the website and I'll put a list of all kind of fruits and vegetables that from my experience I know they have a long uh, shelf life. Thank you for watching till next time bye bye oh by the way <laughs> if you like this video please share uh, like and comment below thank you guys